and that wasn't as elegant as I thought it was gonna be. Good morning, welcome back to another video. Uh, I'm feeling a little bit sorry for myself this morning, feeling a little bit worse for wear. Had a couple of real solid weeks of training, felt felt good, like I've trained, trained hard, and today's a rest day, and it has certainly felt like it's needed to be a rest day. Can feel my legs pretty heavily, uh, so I'm gonna take today as chilled as possible. Right now, I'm gonna head down to Cafe Manor uh, to, do some, to do some work and to edit my vlog from yesterday when I did that real long ride over to Yorkshire, then down into the Lake District. I rode through three counties yesterday. That's pretty insane. But anyway, it's starting to rain, so I'm gonna crack on. I don't even need to say that four letter word beginning with W. They know that the lead is on the coat rack here. So as soon as I go anywhere near here, the dogs get so excited. Check this out. <laughs> Do you know where we're going? <laughs> Do you know where we're going? And then when I actually say that we're going for a walk, are we going for a walk? Why, why do you get so, why do you get so excited? Shall we go for a walk? <laughs> well, this isn't ideal. So whilst I was driving here, flat tire light came on. Hoping that I've not got a puncture. Front right is good. Rear right is good. Rear left is, is fine and so is that one. Why you lie to me like that? Brought the dogs out to somewhere different today, uh, to a place called Burkaker. It's just like a big woodland area and there's a couple of lakes and stuff. But I just got to this, uh, this turning point and that hill right there is not looking also inviting right now. I think I'm gonna go that way. Oh, nice one. That's 30 minutes of walking. I think that's about enough for a day off. Welcome to a new week of training. It seems weird saying that even though it's like Wednesday now because I was riding, I did a long ride Monday, took yesterday off and then back training again today. Uh, it was nice to have yesterday off completely. Definitely, definitely needed it uh, back, back on it today though. And straight back in at the deep end, just doing about a 40 minute loop now before I start my, before I start my efforts. I've got some eight minute zone fives to do today. It's only a short ride. It's only gonna be about two hours in total, but it's gonna be a hard one. So I'm just riding past this dog food factory and every time it absolutely stinks, like the smell is revolting. It just makes you question what the hell goes into some dog food. <coughs> That's two, two out of four, done halfway there. Oh man, these are so hard. These are so hard. I'm trying to keep a high cadence as well today. And oh, mate, it's just killing me. Absolutely killing me. Having to go pretty deep to try to, uh, to maintain what power I wanna, what, 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 what I wanna hold, I can't even speak. Blah! I'm having to go pretty deep to hold my target power. But yeah, halfway there, two more to go. Just as the rain starts, uh, that's three. Starting to really suffer now. So one more to do now before I go home. Yeah, this high cadence stuff is really killing me, especially when I'm so not used to like, riding at such a high cadence. Also trying to ride into a tailwind because I find it just, just psychologically, it makes it a little bit easier when you're going faster. But uh, this last one, which is gonna take me home, is gonna be into a direct headwind. So it's gonna make it hard. So it's gonna make a hard final effort, even harder. Sick.
So I didn't pick up the camera again after after that final effort. I just wanted to get home. I was in a world of pain, uh, but I just want to quickly like look over the efforts. Now I've finished training and come back down to a bit more of a normal uh, a normal level. So I use the Training Peak software uh, to to like to load all my data onto. It's kind of like Strava, just a little bit more uh, details and it's a little bit better for, for analytics. So the main focus today was on the cadence uh, as well as trying to keep a power of at least like 380. So the first one, as you can see from the graphics, I pretty much did bang on. Uh, I had an average cadence of 109 and an average power of 400 or just over 400. But then the second one, I started to fade a little bit, uh, 387 and my, my cadence was still at 10, 108, so still, still in the ballpark. Then my third one, I started to fade even more, 372 watts, so that was slightly lower than like my target, uh, and again, cadence of 110. And then, yeah, finally the last one, I just wanted to get, get absolutely everything out. Uh, my average power there was 377, and my average cadence again, 110, like I wanted to stick to. So, like, I knew that for the last two I was suffering quite a lot, and I just want, the, the idea was just to keep my cadence at 110, uh, and then, almost just go flat out and whatever power I could hold, like that's that's what that's what I could hold. So although I didn't hit the target on on two, well just about two, I mean the last one was almost 380. But yeah, two of the efforts I went below 380 watts. Um, I think that shows that I kind of, I, I don't think I could have, I don't think I could have gone any harder today. It was just the cadence. Like, I know what I can do for eight minute efforts, like four lots of eight minute efforts, just a normal cadence, like 90 watts. But as soon as I try and go above and beyond what my body's used to, it was, it was just such a shock. And literally two minutes into each of the efforts, my legs were screaming. But aside from the riding, whilst I was warming up today, I bumped into one of the viewers that watches these videos and we were, we very very quickly got onto the conversation of, of like of, of Rick and whatever and, and it just reminded me to mention to say like shout out to every single person uh, that sent a message like I literally got between Facebook uh, on my Instagram, Twitter, and even just the YouTube comments like there's so so many messages of you guys and uh, it yeah it kind of just it kind of just like restores your faith in 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 humanity like when you see all these bad things happening and then suddenly like something something bad happens and everyone pulls together and it's, it's 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 so it's amazing to see like so yeah i just want to say thank you to like every single person that sent sent a message it was pretty it was, it was cool to see